When it comes to supporting your students through the UCAS application cycle, there's several measures you can put in place to make both yours and your students' lives easier and to make sure that the applications are all completed on time. It's really important to give your students a key UCAS date from the off. The sooner they can get used to those dates and deadlines, the more time they will have to start planning their post-18 options and to start thinking about their applications and working on them. As a university, we see thousands of applications year on year, and it's really obvious to us which ones have been left to the last minute and rushed, and it can have an overall negative impact on the application. By making your students aware of these dates, it allows them to effectively manage and plan their time, to make an informed decision that's right for them, and to produce a strong application for university. So as well as the key UCAS dates, it's also worth trying to create your own internal deadlines to help the students. By doing this, it allows you to firstly break up the application process for them. For example, by the time they come back in September, they have to have registered on UCAS at least. By doing this, it allows the students a bit extra time if they need to make any amendments before submitting their application. But it also gives you more time as their teachers or tutors to look through their applications and to help give them the best possible advice you can. In addition to the support you provide, many universities also have education liaison teams. Teams of people who are more than willing to come to your school or college and to run sessions and workshops with your students. These sessions can be about any aspect of higher education, whether it's student finance, personal statements, subject taster sessions, or making the most of their next two years studying with you.